Welcome to Travel Scout Channel. For today's video, we will take you to Langkawi, Malaysia. We will be going to explore Langkawi and discover the best places to visit, things to do, what to eat, and everything that makes your stay here memorable. If you want to experience island life, head to the beautiful island of Langkawi, which is off the shore of Penang in Malaysia. The laid-back attitude of Langkawi sets it apart from other regions of Malaysia, and tourists swarm here in droves to enjoy the picturesque beaches and unspoiled landscape. Despite Langkawi's small size, there is a ton to do there, including visiting interesting museums, shops, and other locations like aquariums and craft communities. So let's start exploring Langkawi, Malaysia. Eagle Square. One of the most famous spots in Langkawi is Eagle Square or Dataran Lang in Malay. The plaza is in Kua, the island's capital and major town. And there, at a height of about 12 meters, is a huge statue of an eagle poised to take flight. You can combine a trip here with a number of other attractions because it is near to a number of them, including Taman Legenda, Langkawi. Langkawi Cable Car The Langkawi Cable Car, which will transport you to the peak of Mat Kang Mountain, is one of Langkawi's crowning achievements. The trip takes about 15 minutes, but along the way, you'll get to take in the breathtaking scenery as you pass by gushing cascades and lush rainforests. At the Peaks Observatory deck, which is located at a height of 708 meters, you can see as far as Sumatra in nearby Indonesia on a clear day. Air Hangat Village You should go to Air Hangat Village if you want to unwind in Langkawi. Given that the Malay word for hot water is Air Hangat, a variety of hot springs with purported therapeutic benefits can be found here. Although the waters in these naturally occurring saltwater springs are actually quite hot, it's one of the best methods to relax if you have any aches or pains. Gunung Raya The highest point in Langkawi is Gunung Raya, which rises to the height of 881 meters. This is also the location of another of Langkawi's well-known legends, according to which the mountain was cursed by a giant called Mat Raya. You have the option of going it alone or hiring a guide, but the trek up the mountain can be quite difficult in some places. Pantai Sinang One of Langkawi's most popular and cherished beaches is Pantai Sinang. Given that it is also one of the most well-liked, you will find a ton of activities here that are ideal if you enjoy aquatic sports. Come to the beach in the afternoon to enjoy the spectacular light display because it is also well known for its sunsets. Gilim Geo Park The lovely mangroves that cover Langkawi are credited with protecting the island from the 2004 tsunami and minimizing harm. Due to its significance, this ecosystem is one of the most significant in this region of Malaysia. And the best way to see it is by taking a boat trip of the surroundings. Along with seeing rugged caverns, clear pools, and sections of forest land while boating through the swamp. Telaga Tuju Waterfalls The Telaga Tuju Cascades, which translate to seven pools in Malai, are arguably the most well-known of all the cascades on Langkawi. The falls have a legend associated with them, as does much of the island, and the residents say that fairies reside here. The seven natural pools or wells in the rock wall here are fed by seven distinct cataracts that descend from Mat Sinang Mountain, which is how the waterfalls got their name. Legenda Langkawi If you want to learn more about the mythologies and legends that are associated with Langkawi, consider visiting Taman Lejanda Langkawi, a theme park where you can learn the origins of the island's legends. You can either stroll or take a leisurely buggy ride around the site as the majority of the museum is indoors. 
Langkawi Skybridge. The Langkawi Skybridge, which runs for an impressive 125 meters and is essentially a long pedestrian bridge with breathtaking views of the surrounding countryside, is one of the most well-known locations on the island. Some of Langkawi's neighboring islands, Matsinang Mountain and the Seven Pools Waterfalls, are a few of the sights you will be able to see in the distance. Durian Pernangan One of the lovely waterfalls on Langkawi that you shouldn't skip is Durian Perangan. This is one of the most visited places on the island, and on weekends when residents come to picnic, it can be quite crowded. Since this is a multi-layered cataract, you can pause along the way at the various tiers to take in the scenery. At the foot of the falls, there is a rock pool where you can cool off and swim. Pula Payar Marine Park the distance between Pula Payar Marine Park and Langkawi's main island is about 30 kilometers, and getting there requires a 45-minute scenic speedboat journey. The primary reason to visit the marine park is to see some of the protected natural beauty spots in their region of Malaysia, like the Coral Garden, which is covered in a variety of vibrant coral species. Tengjungru Beach Tengjungru Beach, located in the north of the island of Langkawi, is one of the most beautiful beaches in the region. Clean, white sands can be found at the beach, which is rarely overcrowded because many people are unaware that it is public due to its slightly isolated position. Since you can rent boats at the jetty and tour some of the sites offshore from the beach, this is a wonderful choice if you want to avoid crowds. Oriental Village the Oriental Village is a park and village with an Asian motif that features authentic performances and scale replicas of regional structures. Jugglers, martial artists, and musicians are just a few of the sights on display here. You can also take a kite flying lesson. Pantai Kok One of Langkawi's less popular beaches, Pantai Kok, is about 12 kilometers from Pantai Sinang, the island's largest shoreline. You will find clean sands here and it is a pleasant place to visit if you want to sunbathe away from the crowds because this beach is not as frequently visited as some of the others in the area. Paradise 3D Museum Consider visiting the Art in Paradise 3D Museum if you're searching for a rainy day activity. About 200 various pieces of art that appear to be three-dimensional can be found here and this facility boasts the distinction of being Malaysia's largest museum of 3D art. So what do you think of our video? Please comment down below and don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell for more future updates here on Travel Scout Channel. Thank you for watching.